Tommy, um, game aside, win aside, the milestone today for your brother, what does it mean to you to see him achieve that? Oh, mate, it's, it's huge for us as a family. Like we've, you know, my dad played here. Like Les has always been such a big part of our lives. It's, it's you know, when you when you're here for such a long time, and you you know, and um, you become a part of it so much, and it and it kind of builds into the person you are. So to watch him get 250 games for this great club, this club we love and adore, um, it's just just it's just unbelievable. I'm just so proud of him, the way he's conducted himself over the years, the way he's just been driven to keep getting better and better and better. And you know, there's you know, it's still a lot more to come from him. That that's the exciting thing. And you know, I think it's really important important to acknowledge as well that like, to get a win against your rivals is huge. And I thought the the boys were outstanding today because. We didn't have it go all our way at all, and um, it was fantastic to see that dog in us, you know. And I think that's something we've been talking about a lot. And you know, we, we don't give up fighting, and it was it was great to see that in, in the abundance and to watch Ben play play very well and achieve a huge milestone in his in his rugby career. Your dad was welcomed in. A director's place was given up for him. You were a little bit a part of that surprise. What do you think that meant to Ben? Oh, massive, you know, like Dad, Dad's been a huge part of our career. He's driven us anywhere, everywhere. Um, you know, one thing Dad has never done is put any pressure on us. He just loves watching us play and enjoys it. You know, he's, as he always say, I'm past it now. Our, our day was very different to now, you know, and he's great like that. He doesn't voice an opinion, just enjoys watching us play. And, um, you know, it's good to have him in, in, in to, so Ben knew who's here to um, support him and watch him. He hasn't missed many. Derby games, if any, I think he's watched all second team games, all all the first team games. So he was very excited when I rang him the other day to say, look, you, there's a, there's a spot for you. The club have arranged a spot for you to come in and, and watch the game. So he was he was buzzing about it. How did he go with all his COVID testing? All right, I think I didn't really ask him that. I said you're gonna have to do it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. You know, fair. Look, let's be honest. He lives on a farm in the middle of nowhere. He doesn't see anyone anywhere. So unless the pigs have it. Yeah, unless the pigs have, it, yeah, he's, he's he's the pigs have got right. COVID or anything like that. Um, Geordie said it was a shot in the arm to have that win. Uh, I'm not trying to take away from it, but it's only one win and you can't get too far ahead of yourselves, can no, you? No, you can't, but I think the important thing is here, it's been, it's been building behind the scenes and <clears throat> and I think we showcased it here. Look, are we the finished article? No, we, we, we know that. We, we want to keep working hard and getting better, but the things we've been going after, the game plan was there, like... We went two men down in the line out, so that, that caused pressure for us there. But we dealt with it all. And we were saying to you, we like to throw the ball around. We still defended really well. Um, and that was fantastic. But yeah, as you say, it's, it's, a, it's a huge shot in the arm because when you're down the bottom like we have been, like those little things are huge for us to, to keep building on. And, you know, and as I say, behind the scenes, it's been building. I'm, I'm extremely excited of what, what's going to unfold in the future. Extremely excited about it. And, um, you know, it's a great, great today. Um, the emotion was there from the boys. I made sure they understood what this game means. The new guys there, and, and they did, and they clearly showed that. They showed the passion for the shirt, um, passion to win at Welford Road, we, we, we never give up. Are we starting to see the identity that we've been told has been worked on? Definitely. I think you're starting to see the DNA as well. I think we're starting to see the grit, the determination. Um, you know, and that, that's fantastic. We, we're working very hard behind the scenes and it's it's frustrating when it doesn't quite come on the pitch, but it will come, like it will come. And the step up to the other five, ten percent is always the hard one to get. You know, it takes time, it takes experience, it takes people who come new into it to, to gel into it, to understand it, um, you know, and, and we're on that journey and I thought it was a huge step in the right direction today. I think it's been coming, but it's a massive step in the right direction today against against their old rivals. Finally, who's the better scrum half, your dad or your brother? <laughs> um, <laughs> my dad looked like me playing scrum half, so uh, <laughs> I think you should have played hooker. Like, look, look, aside from it, look, it, uh, Ben... You don't have to answer if you don't want to. Let's be honest, Ben's played 250 games <laughs> with the club. Dad, I think, played 147. Um, so I think... They both achieve great things in their career. <laughs>